We'll first introduce RTM process and talk about the advantages of Modex 3D RTM module. Then we'll get to our primary focus of this session, introducing simulation workflow in Modex 3D Plus, a demonstration. In the demonstration, you will learn how to set up an RTM simulation in Modex 3D workflow. Afterwards, we'll have a look on the case study together. The case study covers some result interpretations as well. First part, introduction to RTM process. In general, composite materials are light in their weight, high in their strength, plus they perform great resistance to acid and alkali, together with resistance to wear and tear. These properties explain why comp composite materials are widely used nowadays, such as daily necessities, yacht, aircraft, wind turbine, automotive industry, and more. Diagram here shows the categories of composite materials. Those materials used in RTM, aka liquid composite molding, belong to continuous type with dry fiber mat. When it comes to their fabric directions, they can be unidirectional, bidirectional, and three-dimensional fabrics. Please refer to the graph on the slide. Among all the composite products, RTM products get remarkable mechanical properties with, great, uh, with larger relative fiber lengths. Moreover, we can expect to achieve weight reduction on your products with RTM process. RTM products are composed of reinforcement and resin. Reinforcement usually gets higher mechanical strength. Some common reinforcement included uh, glass fiber, carbon fiber, Kevlar, and natural plain fibers. For commonly used resin, there are epoxy, vinyl ester, unsaturated polyester, and so on. Here's the common RTM process workflow. Starting from preform preparation, mold closure, resin injection, resin curing, and finally demolding. 